How to remove a core from a cracked bowling ball. All right, guys, so we got for you today the dreaded cracked bowling ball. We've got a radical score that was donated by one of my friends here. That popped on him all the way around. It must have started at the bridge and went all the way around the ball. So we're going to try and get the core out of it. Let's see what we got. You'll need these for simple items. A bowl cup or roll of tape. One thick pair of gloves. A heavy hammer. And a chisel. Now let's get cracking. There's a piece. It's gonna come off in sections more than likely. Seems like anything that doesn't have the carbon fiber. Make an egg, you gotta make an omelet, you gotta crack a few eggs. So, make a mess on the bench here. Right. See what else we do. See, already cracked over here. So, we'll pop this side now. There we go. You can already see the core here. Look at that. And the cores right there too, so shop, you just play around. So let's see if we can get the rest of this to pop here. Ooh, set off a piece. Still on some eye protection. Not the face. Hey, that's radical. <laughs> all balls crack. I don't care what anybody says. I've seen them all crack. Except for the OG urethanes. Anything reactive I've seen crack. I haven't seen too many urethane, rubber, some of the older plastics when they get brittle. careful too you're gonna know, stuff's razor sharp when they come off that will definitely open you up right there well, we're getting there popping pieces off left and right now we're getting at the point where it's not so round anymore so let's see if we can uh, I don't really have a cup holder per se I'm just using a, a roll of tape at the shops workshop not the pro shop and there we go let's see if we get this thing. there we go so that's about it i mean you got the inner core and then that thin piece of your or reactive resin you know some of the older ones they were all two piece completely resin all the way in didn't have this inner core, but those cracked too. So, you know, it is what it is. And I like reactive. I'm not dogging reactive at all. It just, you know, it's one of them things. They just, they just pop. So, yeah. so here's kind of what we got at this point. Side and that side. Let's see if we can get some of the rest of this here. Ooh, we got a nice split here. Probably get split the rest of the way. There we go. There. Wow, look at that. It sounds crunchy. Ooh, that's a nice piece. Now the grips are still in there. there we go. Got a couple grips. I'll just take a razor later and cut them out. Nice piece come off. We're almost good. It is, won't, won't be too hard. A lot of these, let's see, this was, uh, the score was in the mid to late 2000s. These 
tend to come apart pretty easy. So at this point, I gotta make sure I don't cut my hand on this. Let me get some love. Yeah, when you get at this point, definitely put some gloves on or, or put it in a vise or a jig or something like that just to hold it in place. I don't have anything like that at the shop here, so don't want to slice my hand open. I got league tonight. So what kind of ball are you going to roll in your league tonight? Why don't you comment below? I'm rolling a, I'm pulling out the red dot tonight. I'm going to pull out an old red dot. I like the old, old Colonia's. trouble getting the rest of this off. Maybe I'll try it. See if I find another split in it. Or we'll create one. Let's see if I can just pop one down the middle here. See if I can go right in the middle of this USB C. There we go. Nice little chunk came off there. See if we can just bang this off here a little bit. There we go. Now we're talking. Nice little chunk there. All right, now we're on the flip side here. We just got this one segment left. And then we got these little pieces of the outer core, and then we'll have just the, the radical score core. Let me see if I can pop this bad boy off here. And so you want to put that in there. We'll just go right down the middle. Well, we're getting there. Just think of it as the ball coming out of the gutter, hitting that rake arm, shooting a 10 pin. See that night get nice gash every time. I don't know how many times I shot out a 10 pin, ball bounced out of the gutter and hit that sweet break arm. Cracks them every time. And that's what, you know, with these thin resin covers, they hit that sweep, and it's done. Every time. I'm supposed to be throwing about 20, 21, 22 mile an hour at that 10 pin, so. There's a nice little split. Here we go. There we go. Oh, that sounds good. A little ASM there. There's that grip came out. So we got all these pieces here. And just one last piece. So we can just pop that off there. little chunk my kids if you're watching do not start hammering on your bowling balls to get the core out your mom and dad would send me a lot of hate mail and kill me so that's not the idea here this ball was already cracked so we're gonna get this out for a nice little display but right at the moment we still got to get get this stuff off here we'll knock these edges off but there you go i mean you got your core out it's a radical score core. There's where the weight hole was, the balance hole, and the fingers. That might have been the thumb. That was the thumb. Yeah. There's the thumb. There's the fingers. There's the thumb. So that's how that was in, when, in the hand. And the grip, the core was in place right here. Flip with the fingers, and the core wobble. Going down the lane. So that's pretty cool. All right, folks. Well, that's pretty much it. score hey that's radical we'll see you guys next time well there you have it one removed bowling ball core ready to display please be sure like love and follow thanks for viewing